This video is going to be out of order for a while because the last video I did was on Jesus' birth and now I'm going to do Easter and his resurrection and there's a whole bunch of years in between, 33 years to be exact. So it's going to be out of order. Bear with me. In the book of Matthew, chapter 21, it talks about what's called the triumphal entry. And this is when Jesus comes into the town of Jerusalem and people throw down palm branches and wave palm branches at him and they fulfill a prophecy in the Old Testament about the Messiah, the Christ, the Savior, who is coming. In Matthew 21 it says, As they approached Jerusalem and came to Bethpage on the Mount of Olives, Jesus sent two disciples saying to them, Go to the village ahead of you, and at once you will find a donkey tied there with her colt by her. Untie them and bring them to me. If anyone says anything to you, tell him that the Lord needs them, and he will send them right away. This took place to fulfill what was spoken through the prophet. Say to the daughter of Zion, See, your king comes to you, gentle and riding on a donkey, on a colt, the foal of a donkey. The disciples went and did as Jesus had instructed them. They brought the donkey and the colt, placed cloaks on them, and Jesus sat on them. A very large crowd spread their cloaks on the ground, while others cut branches from trees and spread them on the road. The crowds that went ahead of him and those that followed shouted, Hosanna to the son of David! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna in the highest! When Jesus entered Jerusalem, the whole city was stirred and asked, Who is this? The crowds answered, This is Jesus, the prophet from Nazareth in Galilee. Now we're going to cover what is called the Last Supper. And this is in Matthew 26, 17. On the first day of the Feast of Unleavened Bread, the disciples came to Jesus and asked, Where do you want us to make preparations for you to eat the Passover? He replied, Go to the city, to a certain man, and tell him, The teacher says, My appointed time is near. I am going to celebrate the Passover with my disciples at your house. So the disciples did as Jesus had directed them and prepared the Passover. Jesus' death was not a surprise to him. And even here he says in that verse that we just read, My appointed time is near. He knows what's going to happen. When evening came, Jesus was reclining at the table with the twelve. And while they were eating, he said, I tell you the truth, one of you will betray me. They were very sad and began to say to one another, Surely not I, Lord. Jesus replied, The one who has dipped his hand into the bowl with me will betray me. The Son of Man will go just as it is written about him. But woe to that man who betrays the Son of Man. It would have been better if he had not been born. Then Judas, the one who would betray him, said, Surely not I, Rabbi. And Jesus answered, Yes, it is you. While they were eating, Jesus took bread, gave thanks, and broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take and eat. This is my body. And he took the cup, gave thanks, and offered it to them, saying, Drink from it, all of you. This is the blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. I tell you, I will not drink of this fruit of the vine from now until the day when I drink it anew with you in my Father's kingdom. When they had sung a hymn, they went to the Mount of Olives. Here in Matthew 26, 36, it says, Then Jesus went with his disciples to a place called Gethsemane, and he said to them, Sit here while I go over there and pray. He took Peter and the two sons of Zebedee along with him, and he began to be sorrowful and troubled. Then he said to them, My soul is overwhelmed with sorrow to the point of death. Stay here and keep watch with me. Going a little further, he fell with his face to the ground and prayed, My father, if it is possible, may this cup be taken from me. Yet not as I will, but as you will. Then he returned to his disciples and found them sleeping. It continues on, and then it says, Then he returned to his disciples and said to them, Are you still sleeping and resting? Look, the hour is near, and the Son of Man is betrayed into the hands of sinners. Rise, let us go. Here comes my betrayer. <laughs> 